It's great how the whole town has came together to, like, help Ethan, I guess. Because of his step-father figure. His father figure died. What happened here? Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> survivors, I see. Ducky. Who are you? Are you the bartender here? Nope. Monster ate all of the staff. We'll have to serve ourselves. Do you know what this key is for? <laughs> Belong to Barry, the tavern keeper. That's his leg over there. <laughs> oh. So, if you want to try all of the locks, I'm sure he won't stop you. He looks like a fucking gnome. <laughs> Let's see what we can find around here. I'm a genius for convincing Steph that my character should be alone behind the bar. All the drinks I want. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. Uh... Is he taking free yes? drinks? He's having free drinks. I see you've poured yourself some ale. I heard Barry the Tavern Keeper has a son, Ned, who's very observant. <laughs> so, Barry's like a hundred years old? How did you survive? How did you survive the attack? Well, I'm not proud of it, but I tripped an elderly woman. <laughs> she had it coming. Stingy dish wench. <laughs> she fucking tripped an elder. That is that is fucking terrible, bro. <laughs> Wanna tell him about our quest? We're on a quest to end the Age of Monsters. So you won't have to live in fear anymore. Are you now? Let me give you something that you may find useful. Thanks. What's I'm going to go ahead and guess we'll be meeting a snake. Uh, snakes within hearing must fall asleep. Okay. Dude, we have so many fucking scrolls, bro. We're gonna keep looking around. Good luck. Dude, I can't believe this guy just like pours himself a fucking drink to make him feel at home. Alex is right. But I was just trying to have a little fun. Gotta pace out that fun, Ducky. For your own good. Dude, he pours himself the, the, the owner of the bar trusts him to be behind the fucking counter role-playing. Well, he's outside, and he is literally fucking stealing from him. Like, just trying to have a little fucking fun, bro. He's literally stealing. I bought alcohol this fucking, this, the, the last night. Technically last night, because now it's the morning. <laughs> and... Oh, shit. I one health elf bird. I only have one fucking attack. Stirring Heim. Double Thanor's next attack. That's actually really good. Four damage for a stab. Three damage to enemies plus one damage to allies. One per battle only. Stab two damage, burning blade. One damage plus one damage over the next two turns. Okay. So it's good to start off with burning blade. Uh. 
And we got a map here that's obviously the town. Steph really went all out in here. <laughs> Ugh, rough day for Barry the Tavern Keeper. That might be the key. That might be the lock for the key. Thanor! Did you see this? That's got to be it! It's one of the jewels! Fuck yeah, we fucking found it, bro. One down, two more to go, bro. That's th that was easy. <laughs> One down, two to go. That wasn't there. so bad, right? Now I feel more confident we can find the others. Why do you finally believe in us? My <laughs> That's not what I meant. My thoughts exactly. In retrospect, this is so obviously a decoy. Chest. House Bard. Sorry, Steph. Alwyn is pretty happy with her current gig. Still. Yeah. Uh. Coin. We'll take a fucking coin. Now we have two. Gabe's plaque. I want to focus on Ethan right now. 1993 to 2019. What happened to the rest of the music? Class bird. Sheet music. What happened to the rest of the music? Skill Hypnotic Fatigue. That means, like, every monster has to know, like, what the fucking powers are. The 13th Quinquennial Meeting of the Daegu Biscuit Boys is hereby called to order. I'm sorry to announce that all six of us remain upright and above ground. First point of order. Ducky, if you had to guess, though, about how much longer are you fixing to live? Just long enough to collect, Gordon, and not a minute longer. Ducky is in a tontine. A tontine? What the fuck's it? Ducky is in a tontine. What's a tontine? I literally don't know what a tontine is. I'm gonna have to look this one up, I guys. literally did not know, like, what a tontine is. And... An... An anidity shared by subscribers to a loan or common fund. The shares increasing as subscribers die until the last sur survivor enjoys the whole income. A life insurance plan in which the benefit Beneficiaries are those who survive and maintain a policy to the end of a given period. So literally, it's like, it's an agreement that the last surviving person gets the money. That, that I've never heard of that before. A tontine. I've never heard of that. That, that, is, that is very interesting. I should make one of those. <laughs> Scroll. Here we go. This probably has the answer to that riddle. Ah, uh, the legend of the soul jewels. Long ago, it is said that said when unspeakable terrors reign, even in daylight, four heroes face the great shadow of the Kalinian shores. For days, the battle raged until the powers of the great shadow overwhelmed the four heroes, pushing them to the brink of death. There, among waves stained with blood three of the heroes gave their lives calling upon an ancient spell that pulled the souls from their bodies and fastened them into three stones of immeasurable powers power 
from Nira the Berserker, strongest of the four, came the Soul Ruby. From Diz the Cleric, weaver of stories, came the Soul Sapphire. From Belin the Illusionist, keeper of the old books, came the Soul Amethyst. With all three souls jewels in hand, the, f- the fourth hero took up, took up their sword and struck down the great shadow, piercing it with light. Then, wary of the bloodied, wary and bloodied from battle, the fourth hero hid the jewels away and wandered into the deep wilds of Rune, never to be seen again. I mean, it doesn't tell us where they are. One of them is in a fucking box. Guess Lawrence is gonna need a new business advisor. Okay. I guess that's it. I guess that was everything in here. I was having such a quiet morning. <laughs> We're gonna have to deal with this, aren't we? Okay. Did you see this warning? Yeah. Bye. So I guess we we've been to the forest. We have to go down to the road, and I guess towards the bridge. I mean, that's our that's our next stop. I assume. Unless maybe there's, like, a- another business owner that just so happened to open up their business for this fucking LARP. I mean... Yes, yeah, so let's shut down all business hours for a stupid fucking game. Check out what I found in that chest. One dodge, you can realize what dodge the next attack. Nice work, Thanor. I doubt we're going to need all these fucking scrolls. <laughs> Dire wolf. Ooh, serpent. Hiss. Is there any messages? Riley sent I us a message. I should probably drop in on Riley and thank her in person. Well, I guess we there should. There was some really interesting stuff in there. I guess we should stop by this shop. Sorry. Hey, kid. You responsible for that massacre in the Black Lantern? We're the good guys. <laughs> right. Of course. Scroll of Advantage. Junior Ellis gain an extra turn. We're like master scroll seekers. Yup. I love how all the adults are in on this shit. Go get them, Ethan. I'm Thanor. Could there be something down the alley? Well, since she mentioned it, probably. It's boring. Why is my dead lover talking? Shh, they're here. <laughs> Woe is me. Woe is me. Behold, my love has been slain by yonder river monster. Where? Just down the... Yonder... Alley, near the river. Alas, alas. <laughs> she tried. Wow, that actually felt really sad. Yeah, right? <laughs> I would definitely miss you. Beware, Beware of river monster. Dude, it's Ryan again! <laughs> Some kind of snake? I guess. 
I love how they got Ryan to do all the fucking monsters. <laughs> oh, we got some fucking attacks, all right. <laughs> do we have to fight it? Why wouldn't we? I mean, it's just fucking around. It's cute. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of cute, isn't it? Ooh, shit. What are you talking about? You'll learn when you're older, kid. <laughs> it's gonna attack. What do you want to do? Bell. What the fuck's Bell? Ophidian chime. Snakes within hearing must fall asleep. Pretend that's a low sound. Snakes' ears are internal, so they can't hear. Nice. Good. We don't have to fucking kill it. <laughs> Good, another fucking coin. More loot. All right, let's make New some new skill acquired. Bleed. Class bard skill. Disharmony. Horrid disharmony. Attacks three. Wait. What's that? Is that a, the other gem? It's like a dragon scale or something. Maybe it's got magical powers. Let's hang on to it. Is that not the other gem? Yeah. Okay. I thought we needed three of those. That was so smart of you to use the bell. Shit. That didn't take long. Uh. Fuck Typhoon. I remember they said there's something at the bridge. Well, we can't go this way. How did they fucking- oh, shit, okay. One dodge. I saw that! Like, right before you picked it up! Okay, you can have the credit. <laughs> no, I don't care. Okay, we handled the rivers- Here you've dealt with the river serpent, huh? More than just talk, are you? Oh, what a thankless life, being a smith in the age of monsters. Whoa, he's really into this. <laughs> Everything okay? You seem pretty, um, grumpy. What did you need again? What? Sun silver? The components for sun silver. <laughs> sun really silver. How many people Steph's roped into this? The ma magpie and podium. Please knock twice. Go for it. Okay. Might as well. Love how they got this little fucking town to just like drop everything. Monster or mortal? Mortal! Come in. <laughs> Maybe we can find what this fucking uh, blacksmith needs in here. Sorry about the lock. 
These are dangerous times. Welcome to the Magpie Emporium. Oh, so this is like a magic shop. <laughs> I'm gonna take a look around a bit, okay? Okay. Let's see what Steph's done to the place. When Alex said I'm hot, did she mean it? Wait, what? Or was she just messing around? Never seen Steph feel this way before. Maybe I could reassure her. She's always so confident. Uh, when did we tell her she was hot? <laughs> I'd like to try one of those bard instruments, please. You'll need to schedule a private appointment. I'll do that. How does Steph come up with all these names? Man, my dating life could have used a truth spell or two. As a classically trained bard, I gotta say, this music's not bad. He's forging the Sky Sword of Power. Oh yeah? That actually looks legit. Looks fucking creepy, that's what it does. Golems, animation fee not included. Oh, Steph. Wonder if they have drills for this. Gather those who matter. Casper to a circle. Okay. It's a wonder Valkyrie's ever hungry. What, with all the human flesh I assume she consumes? <laughs> I guess some heroes are into bards with flashy guitars. But I'm glad Thanor has better taste. Kitty. Warning. Cat is cursed. Do not pet. Yeah, no need to warn me. Kitty. Tarot cards. What do I want insight about? Mm, people. Ryan. Is that true for Ryan? I hope so. A card for inspiration, optimism, and hope for the future. People. Steph. Hmm. Really? A card for self, surrendered fates, and accepted and unknown embraced. People. Me. Uh, what? The lovers, a card for necessary choices equal temptations and divergent paths. Well, shit, we have to pick someone. That's what they're telling us. My power. Chaos and destruction. Carb yeah. Chaos. <laughs> no shit. Oh, shit. Haven. Yikes. Death. Typhoon. Holy shit. Too real. The devil. Okay. Yeah, seemed pretty much right. Spells. Very cute stuff. Are these spells for sale? To members of the Sorcery Guild only. Sorry. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it. Okay, I guess we talked to stuff. The streets used to be full of people. Well, we've already shop. The soul sapphire's right there. For sale. What do we need? Why is this 10,000 gold? Was I too generous? It was originally 20,000, but No, I meant Never mind. Maybe we can make some kind of deal with her. Well, if we got to. Would you consider giving us that sapphire? Oh, shit. For my hand in marriage. <laughs> in exchange for something far more valuable. Oh, my shit. My hand. In marriage. And... All of its associated benefits. 
<laughs> you should know I wouldn't offer if I didn't mean it. Shit, now we gotta go to his staff. Fuck. <laughs> Ethan's fucking confused, uh, bro. I mean... Oh, man. This just got real. <laughs> <laughs> Even he knows. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't intrigued. But I'm afraid I can't accept. For now. Intrigued, you say? We need the sapphire right away. It's for a quest to end the age of monsters. End the age of monsters. I've heard there's a magical fish that lives in the river of sorrows. Bring me back one of its scales and I'll give you the sapphire in return. <laughs> <laughs> we already One fucking got this magic fish scale impressive well then here's my end of the bargain marriage didn't work god damn it <laughs> God, let's just have a polyamorous one relationship. More jewel left. Getting there. <laughs> With Ryan and stuff. Scroll of nimbleness, scroll of healing, scroll of adventure. Troll dust. So there's definitely a troll at the eastern bridge. Do you think we can beat a troll? Three gold, please. Okay. Troll dust, what the fuck does that do? What the fuck does scroll what the fuck does troll dust do? Oh shit, she's into it. We're just fucking we're fucking over there, bro. I might I might go with it with Ryan. Shit. We we're leading her on, bro. Fuck. <sighs> I shouldn't have done that. Now I kinda feel bad. Cause I'm I'm I might go with Ryan just to go against the grain here. I'm still thinking about that tapestry. Two, three, I control me. One, two, three, I control me. This book is written for fucking toddlers. Ooh, nothing like getting pissed off at your anger management book. <laughs> at least he's trying. How can- Hey, we found the components of Sun Silver. Did we? It's all right. Listen here. Since you two already defeated the serpent, maybe you can handle the troll around the bridge. Did you see this scroll first? Uh, no. All right. He's brave and he's honest. Did Charlotte want to talk? Oh, well, shit, there's another stroll. Dude, they're giving us way too many fucking Stocking scrolls. Stocking up on scrolls. Yes, exactly. I guess Charlotte doesn't want I to talk. I wonder how Riley's doing with the USB. That run felt amazing. I'm so proud of myself. Wow. Good for her. Good job. I remember when I used to, to run. No, I don't. Mind if I duck in here a second? I have to talk to Riley about a real life thing. I promise I'll be quick. Sure. Take your time. Just 
don't go anywhere. Don't go into the mine. Don't run away and go into the fucking mines again. <laughs> or into the mountains, rather.